All right, watch this quick video on how to make either a pie chart or a bar graph from a demographic variable, which is a categorical variable. Okay, so we're going to start here. Have you ever bought a new car? I did once a long time ago. So no is a two and one is a yes. So we got to count how many twos and ones. Let me show you a big shortcut here. I would highlight all the data. And then I would go over to... Sort A to Z. We'll just go from largest to smallest. Does it make any difference? And it put them in order there. You see that? So now I'm going to put a counter box here. And it just basically counts for us. So how many twos we have? We have 14 twos. So over here, I'm going to put... No, and then I'm going to put the, the amount, 14 no's, and how many yeses were there? There was from 15 to 26, so 26 minus 15 is 11, plus 1 is 12, so we got 12 yeses, and let's double check here to make sure that our total adds up to 26. 14 plus 12 is 26. Okay, so we this is the format now. Now that this is the correct format, we're going to go ahead and I'm going to put these into a pie chart first. You highlight the data. You go to insert. I always go to recommended charts. And I'm going to pick that one. There's a nice pie chart. But I'm not in love with the color. I'm going to go up here and I'm going to pick a fancier one. And no, 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 no. No, 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 plain, 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 plain. I actually like the one with the percents on it. So I'm going to leave it there. And I'm going to change the chart title to buy a new car, question mark. And that one's done. There's your bar chart. I'm sorry, there's your pie graph, right? Pie chart. Now I'm going to remake another one. But this one's going to be a bar graph, Okay. So same thing, you highlight the data, go to insert, recommend charts, and we're just going to pick that plain one. And I'm going to move it, right? I could put it anywhere. And again, I'm not in love with this chart. I'm going to pick this one because it's got the numbers on there. And again, I'm just going to change the title. New car. Boom. So that's how you do a pie chart and a bar graph in Excel. Hope this helps. MGZ out.